Joining us now is Dev Randhawa, Chairman and CEO at Fission 3.0. Great to see you, Dev. Well, thanks for having me on, Mark. So this discovery you've made, we, we talked to your VP of Exploration, Ray Ashley, the other day, yeah. and yeah. he said the team is overjoyed. Uh, that first hole was phenomenal. Everybody's very excited. Uh, and I think in large part because Ray was saying you've hit a 15 meter wide structure and then right. the follow up hole was encouraging as well. So uh, as most people know in the uranium space, you've been part of two big discoveries, Triple R and Waterbury. So uh, what is the significance of what you found here, do you think? Well, you know, time will tell, to be straight up. You know, we've got, um, we had discovery hole and the follow up. Um, and what we're doing, our plan was to have and below and on the side, three more holes for Christmas, uh, send people home, let them have a break. Um, then they're going to be back out there. This project's on land, so we don't have the big delays. With Triple R, we had to always wait <coughs> Till the ice was so thick until you go on the lake. We don't have those issues here. This is on land and it's still shallow 200 meters. So um, it's the right place and it's so close to the others, you know, so that there's infrastructure, there's a camp there. We don't have to reinvent all that. Um, no, it's, it's, it's the best from what I've seen. You know, I've, had, I've seen people send me information saying this is what next gen era was like. This is what ISO was like. If there's an, uh, Uranium was like, so all those, the hurricane, the triple R, uh, the arrow, they're all amazing deposits. They're world-class, but this has a better discovery hole. So to me, um, it's like starting on the 50 yard line versus on the 10 yard line. Now all those deposits, their eventually follow-up holes were much bigger um, because as you drill more, you understand um, how it's moving, where it's come from. Um, the geometry, the attitude, Ray would say. So we've got two holes, two more to go. Um, Christmas ends. By that time, we'll have assays. And then we really know. Um, but I'm very proud of the team. You know, it's rare people make one discovery, uh, let alone three. Um, it just goes to the talent level that Ross put together early on. And he's the director now but, and Ray's the leader. But it just tells you what a great job. Uh, Ross did early, putting the other team, and Ray has taken over the reins here and done a wonderful job. Um, what captures my attention is the width, but also the counts per second. Um, that you don't, it doesn't always correlate exactly to, but we have some information in the background. Um, we use the same what machines we used before, they're calibrated, and in fission uranium, when we had over 65,000 counts per second, it was 50% uranium. So we know we've got some width, excellent grade. Um, it's shallow. It's on land. Uh, we have the money to drill uh, through Christmas, and we'll do a financing as soon as we know kind of more of what we've got. You know, you got to be careful taking money. You know, if we have two more excellent holes, obviously the stock will be higher. Um, we want to make sure we keep the dilution down the best we can. And also, when you announce a financing mark in these tough times, um, people stop buying because they can buy it in the private placement. So right now we want uh, we want to keep our momentum um, and at the same time get more data. Dev, you always say drilling is expensive and uh, racing. You want to be systematic here and careful. So how do you go about doing that? You, you sort of explained a bit of it there, uh, short term. But how do you right. how do you do that to make sure you're you're uh, sure. going about it the right way? Well, the key is to be having people like Ray around because they've gone through two discoveries before one at the unconformity, which was the, the J zone. And then triple R um, was been wiped away. If you look at some of the maps, you'll see that the boundaries like this, triple R is below arrows over here in it. And then you were up, we're above. So the nice thing is there's infrastructure there. Bryson done on drilling. It is expensive um, because they're deep holes, but um, every time you drill and you add, you know, 5 million pounds at 50 bucks, right? So if you can ask pound in those, it's worth the drilling. It's certainly been worth it for arrow, certainly worth it there. But the key is, you know, you uh, having a team, it's not their first rodeo of a discovery. They already knew when the first hole was done, 
Ray already had the other ones ready. The boys all got together, got excited, congratulated themselves. They already know we went up dip on the second one. We'll go down dip on the next one we're casing right now. And we'll do one to the side, stop and evaluate. Um, you know, but it's the best start anybody's ever had. Um, so we're excited and we're looking for the next two holes. Right. So just to wrap it up here, uh, two previous discoveries, Triple R, Waterbury. Uh, you're kind of talking like this may be the third one. Is it too early to say that? It's going to be all about the data. But is it, are your spidey senses uh, tingling? Is that what you're thinking oh. and feeling? Uh, I won't say, but an analyst um, said, look, he he normally waits for assays. But when you got two holes like this, this is a discovery. You say it's a big discovery, but it's a discovery. Yeah, so I'm very, again, I'm very proud of our team and their ability to uh, keep, uh, we're, they're like, you know, bulldogs. And they go so hard at it. And, uh, and you, you, you know, you see enthusiasm from Ray, how excited he is. So, yeah, I'm very proud of them. I'm proud of all the people uh, who took the risk with us to give us money to explore, the flow through fun guys, the hard money guys. Um, we said discoveries matter. They do. <laughs> all right. Uh, great stuff, Dev. Uh, we'll uh, keep watching and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you for your time. Okay, Dev Renhau, uh, Chairman and CEO of Fission 3.0.